In this video, you will learn how to remove your bike's wheels. This is essential for carrying out various maintenance work on your bike, such as replacing an inner tube. It can also make your bike easier to transport. This video will be split into three sections, disengaging the brakes, removing the front wheel, and removing the rear wheel. Depending on whether you have quick release or traditional wheel unlocking systems, you may need an adjustable spanner to perform this task. Disengage the brakes to allow enough space for the width of the tire to pass through. Depending on the type of brakes you have, this can be done either by pulling on a lever or by removing part of the brake cable, commonly referred to as the noodle or L-bend pipe. If you don't have a specific lever, squeeze the two brake arms together and lift the noodle to release it. Flip your bike upside down so that it rests on its saddle and handlebars, or use a bike stand if you have one. Section 1. Front wheels. For quick release wheels, swing open the lever and unscrew it just a few turns, blocking the nut on the other side with your hand until the wheel can be removed. For traditional, non-quick release wheels, the process is the same, but you will need an adjustable spanner to loosen the nut at the axle. Section 2. Back wheels. Change gears so that the chain is in the smallest bracket. For quick release wheels, swing open the lever and unscrew it a few turns with your hand. Lift the back derailleur, if you have one, so that the wheel does not hit the jockey wheels as it's removed. Move the chain to one side. For traditional wheels, use an adjustable spanner to unscrew the bolt at the axle and repeat the process. Repeat the steps in reverse order to put your wheels back on. Enjoy your ride. 